I want to tell you a story about how someone went from being a janitor to an IT lead in 48 hours. I know it sounds crazy. I know it sounds fake, but this is a true story. Like I actually know this person personally now. Now this person's story starts around four or five months ago. He is actually a US cybersecurity master's student. And this guy couldn't find a job. He'd been searching for four or five months and he needed to pay his bills somehow. So he, he landed a job as a janitor. Now, about three weeks before that, he had joined our community and he had started doing some hands-on projects, but we'll get to that in a bit. So he starts his job as a janitor. Day one, completely normal day, just getting into the routine of things. And day two comes along, he's in the marketing department and he's mopping the floors. And he hears someone in the marketing department talking about this website build that they were doing and they were struggling with it. And he thought, oh, I actually did something similar to this. So he went up to them and he said, hey, like I heard you were talking about this website build and they kind of like pushed him off a little bit. But he said, oh, I actually did a project on this last week and he pulled out his portfolio and showed them. He showed them the work that he had done. And the only reason he could do this is because he documented his work and everything that he'd been doing was documented to show them what he had done. They were so impressed. They were like, this is exactly what we need that they said on the spot, why are you a janitor? You, I actually think that you should be leading this project. Do you want to become our IT lead? Cause that school was looking for an IT lead at the time that was unknown to them. And he had just taken a chance, taken a job as a janitor and then ended up landing this role as an IT lead on the second day of his job. It's obviously a crazy story, but there is a few lessons in here. Number one, document all your work. With this student, he did our projects and he added in his screenshots and he wrote his documentation. He answered all the questions. And at the end of the project, he downloaded his documentation. He added it to his portfolio. I think he had one portfolio on our website and he actually made another portfolio and added some stuff on LinkedIn, added it on GitHub and actually showcased his work to people. Now, this is such a big lesson. If you're doing projects, if you're doing work, you should be documenting what you're learning so that you can showcase it to others. So that you can actually prove your skills because recruiters don't care if you've got a certificate or if you've got a degree, they cared about actually showing the skills and you can't do that if you don't document it. So even if you don't use our website, that's okay. Just make sure that you document your projects. The second thing that he did is he took a job that wasn't related to his exact dream job. Now I'm not saying that everyone should take a janitor position, but he did that. He had the courage to take a job because he needed money and he needed to pay his bill. So he took a job that wasn't related to being in cybersecurity. Now, because he had documented his work, and he was able to communicate it with other people, he landed the job. But maybe for you, maybe you're going for a cloud engineer position, but right now you can only get a cloud support engineer position. Maybe it's worth taking that job so you can leverage it. You can work your way up in the company because who knows what opportunities will arise. Now that's not blanket advice, but maybe it could be something that could be helpful for you because everyone's career path is not linear and that is completely okay. I know that this is not the usual content that I do, but I wanted to tell this story because it honestly made a big impact to me and I hope it can make a big impact to you and serve as encouragement to keep going, keep grinding, keep doing those projects, keep putting in the work, keep documenting it, sharing it with other people and the results will come, my friend. Peace out.